In this presentation we're going to look at using the script editor. First I'm going to look at the command line interface again and what I mean by that is typing commands <clears throat> in where you, when you are prompted like, I'm, like I am doing now. So k equals 12, h equals 14 let's say, k times h 168. That is the most intuitive approach um, particularly for a beginner and a lot of beginners would learn R in the first instance by using these commands like like I've done there, command line interface. Later on though when you were uh, coding uh, with mo much more complex functions and much more complex characters and terminology and notation and so on you would require to sometimes correct uh, a piece of code or a line or something like that or replace a character now a very useful uh, facility of R is the inbuilt uh, script editor. I'm going to what I'm going to do here is I'm going to set up a new script here. First off, I'm going to rearrange this window. So this uh, here on the right hand side is my script editor. I just put it over there. Over here we have the R console, which is the where the the commands get processed and the output is returned. I just first off draw your attention up here to the top left hand corner and these icons here open script, load workspace, save workspace and so on. These are associated with R console. I'm going to activate the untitled or the R editor. The, we have open script, save script and run line or selection. You just notice that we have different icons here. That's actually quite important. Now what I'm going to do is start off a new script here. So I'm going to write square root of k or plus logarithm of h to the base 3. Now to run this line of code what I'm going to do is highlight it and I'm going to press this button here run line or selection so that gets passed to for processing and we get the output there suppose I've made a mistake and I should have logged uh, had logged to the base 2 I can rather than re rewrite the whole thing out again all I have to do is just edit 2 there and process the corrected uh, piece of code now I'm going to save this down. I'm going to save my edit, uh, my ed uh, script, save as. And I'm going to call it new one. I've actually got a one there already called new one, but there we go. Now, so I'm going to close this down. Suppose I'm coming back tomorrow, the day after, and I want to see my work or continue my work. What I would do here is I would go to open workspace, and a little window comes up here. There we have it there. And this uh, reopens the script I was working on yesterday and I can continue on with it and I find that I need the exponential of k for some reason. And now I'm uh, able to start working, uh, continue working uh, from where I left off yesterday.